guys. How are y'all doing today? Great. It's Court Court and Queen K. All right, so we're starting another taste testing, and we have, what do we have here? We have fried chicken skin. From Wallace's. It was a dollar and forty nine crispy fried chicken skin. See, I don't eat pork, but my mom eats pork skins. But I guess it's in the same factory. But I'm sure that they put it, keep it away from uh, the pork. Um, this is chicken skins, rice flour, salt, seasoned salt, including paprika and turmeric, MSG, onion, cornstarch, garlic, tri calcium phosphate. There's something else that I can't uh, read, but it hasn't killed me yet with soybean oil. Okay, so we're going to go ahead. She's over here snacking on some sunflower seeds. Kids love their sunflower seeds, and, and they love their takis. We're going to try out these rolls. Spring rolls from Dollar Tree. All right. All right, so we're going to go ahead and start with this, the chicken skins. And these are from Spartanburg, South Carolina, and they have a phone number, 864-573-5678, and it's brimsnacks.com, that's B-R-I-M, snacks.com. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and open it up. I do it. Mind like you, pro. chicken skins usually come in like a little pack like that. When the pork skins come in a big pack like that, I'm like, why do chicken skins don't come in a big pack? Maybe they're really, really good. Little girl. Maybe. I never tried it before. Ugh, it's hard to open. Nothing ain't gonna crawl in this. Alright, so this is how the pack looks. We just open it like that. Yep. And the chicken skins look something like this. We're gonna get. What does it smell like? It smells like the real ones. Okay. And if we don't like it, we're gonna get our drinks. This is my CS fruit one. Tastes like chicken skin. Is it seasoned good? Yes. I think I'm, when I'm done with this, I think I'm gonna eat. I think one. some people put hot sauce on it too. You wanna get some? Mm hmm. Okay. Got some hot sauce. That was good. This one, I said that. Good morning. I would like to speak privately with my fellow kids. State. Mm. Mr. McCartney wishes to ask his interest. Not bad. Not that bad. Especially when you're like traveling and you, you ain't got time to go cook nothing. That's good. I think. Mm. Soldiers eat pork skin. I heard soldiers ate um, beef jerky, you know, when they're traveling and on the road, keep them going. Cause you know, sometimes they ain't got time to go to a stove or a restaurant. They got to have something in their body to sustain them. But why pork skin? I mean, it's easy and it's the closest thing to meat. Well, they want meat. Mm -hmm. Pretty good. But you know what I would like? What? If pork skins had different kind of flavor. They are. Like if they had like more than barbecue flavor. This one's the original flavor. But I wish pork skins, I mean, well, not pork skins, but chicken skins. I wish chicken skins had like, like a cheesy taste or like a, a sweet chili kind of taste. Chili. You know, like the purple Doritos? That'd be great. Purple Doritos nasty sometimes. I love purple Doritos. They be tasting fun. Mm -hmm. That'd be great. Okay, so stay tuned. Okay. 
Next one. Now we're working on the next one. Where's the packaging? <coughs> I'll go get it. <coughs> I ate that too fast. <coughs> go ahead. Go find the packaging. I'm greedy. Here it is. So this is the packaging. We have more though. It's spring rose from Jennifer's Garden. It was one dollar from Dollar Tree. You get ten of them. It is all natural, no artificial ingredients. Three rolls per serving, fifty-five calories per roll. No cholesterol, no MSG. And subscribe it's to this channel. It's quick and easy. Microwave, bake, or fry, and it takes as little as two minutes. They're really, really good. So we're gonna try some duck sauce. I believe. Later. And so we're gonna try some duck sauce. We had got some duck sauce from um, our collection. You know when you order takeout. So. How much gets on? It's about this. Oh, she's tripping. It's about this size. You got some. About the size of my finger, pointer finger, somewhat. Not and really. it's round, of course. You can fry it, you can bake it, or you can put it in the microwave if you like. It has like celery, not celery, is it celery? Celery, onions, and carrots. Mm -hmm. And the bouillons with y'all, I don't even eat carrots, mm -hmm. but I eat them with this. Mm. It's the closest thing to Chinese food. Jennifer did a good job. You think so? Jennifer didn't make me. Mm. It says cabbage, carrots, mushrooms, green beans. Mushrooms? Vermicelli, salt, spice, vegetable oil, palm, peanut, sesame, soy, potato starch, crust, wheat flour, water. It's distributed in New Jersey. It's a product of China. And they have an email address. Comment at jennifergarden.com. Pretty good. And here's some history. It says the spring roll originated in China over a thousand years ago. Originally a cherished dish to celebrate the Lunar New Year. Like the original, the chefs at Jennifer Garden use a, a delicate pastry wrap that cooks to a crispy golden brown in today's home ovens. Modern Diners in East and West love to dip the rolls into a variety of sauces, including Chinese sauce, Thai sweet chili sauce, or Vietnamese sweet and sour sauce. Full moon or not, these rolls are cause for a celebration anytime. And yeah. So, I guess we got a little something healthy and something not so healthy. <laughs> so, okay. Well, we're done for today, and y'all take care. Goodbye. Well, don't say goodbye. We're still on. Subscribe to our channel. Wait, let me direct the channel. Okay, bye.